welcome back guys to another video i know i haven't posted in a long time but i have been working on my gaming setup and i may just give you guys a little tour but right now i want to show you the gaming keyboard i just bought let me open up it first guys okay now that i have it i have the box put open now let's take a look I have the I have a mechanical keyboard Eagle Tech. It is compatible with a lot of things, including a PS4 and Xbox. Um, I'm sorry that I haven't posted in a while. Like I said, I've been working on my gaming setup, and it has took me a little bit. Okay, now that I have the box open, let's take a look at the keyboard. Oh, these are all the pictures. so excited oh my gosh this is what a mechanical keyboard sounds like if you guys are wondering this is I think a 80% 87 key mechanical keyboard so it's not a full mechanical keyboard because you have like um pad where you have like the numbers Okay, well, let's plug this bad boy up really fast. Take this out. Set this on the floor. This is my mouse that I bought for like 40 bucks at Walmart. It's a very high quality mouse. Feels very good to the hand if you had a big hand. Uh, and then I bought this. Amazon Basics mouse pad. It was like um, seven dollars. I bought all this stuff at the same time, but coincidentally, this mouse pad came first. Now let's unplug it. I meant plug it up. Oh my gosh, this is a beauty. Um, let me um, do that wire. Okay. Um, I think you control the lighting with this. Yeah, you control the lighting like that. Very variations. Of Sorry guys, I don't know how to control them. I guess I'll look it up on YouTube how to control the lighting. It is very hot already. So I gotta say the mouse pad is kind of tilted up. So if your thumb does work on a PS4 I just plugged it up I don't have a PC yet but I'm gonna get one for my birthday so this one. Oh, there it is this is actually fire you just press I and S you zoom in So you press F N and I N S to change the color. That was beautiful. It's like a rainbow. And you have this. It's like a smooth. And you have a normal. And we're showing all that. The moving keys. Mm. Where it shows half and then full. And then I think it resets. Yeah. Okay. So yeah, that's the keyboard. Oh no, it does this. Press that. 
I don't know how you change the colors, but I will put you guys back on one. I know how. Okay. Hey guys, so it doesn't change colors like I thought it did, but you could change the volume mute right there with F9, 10, and 11. 12, I don't think it does anything. Um, you could press it on the calculator, F3, you could go to search on F2, and you can go to home, I think on F1. And you could change the colors, like how I said earlier. You could go up, down, side to side with the WSD keys on this side. The up and down forward. And that's really it. Um, it is plastic on the bottom. You can pull these down. How is it dirty already? Anyway, you can pull these down. So like the front end lifts up. And it is rubber. If I could pull them up. Okay, well I can't pull them up right now. Hold on, let me try. Okay pull. guys, so I got the things out. It did take kind of a lot of pressure to pull them out. I mean, kind of a lot of force, but they're out now. And this space bar does uh -huh. feel a little bit more comfortable in the hand. But overall, I think this is a good keyboard. I guess I will make sound videos with the keyboard with this variation because I really like this variation. So you can see like how many times I pressed it or like if I press it. But I don't know. But it will be that video coming out soon. See you guys later. Stay safe. And...